Welcome back to Corby Q. I am Corby and today I'm making another burger. My buddy Steve came by. I'm gonna feed him some dinner. We're making a uh, caramelized bacon, onion, and Parmesan encrusted burger. Let's get this rolling. All right, come on in here. What's up? This is my buddy Steve. I've known this guy since we was we little, little babies. We baby. We little babies. So he came over today to help me with. Yeah, you gotta look here. Don't look over at this. Yep. <coughs> so he came over here to help me with my refrigerator. That is apparently a lost cause. Dead the door now. So I'm gonna make him some dinner. Make him a burger that I'm testing out on him. He is gonna give it a taste and let you know what he thinks. You'll probably smell it later. <laughs> probably. <laughs> Get the camera over on the food and I'll show you what we're working with. So I've got some uh, Cajun smoked bacon that was given to me by my cousin. We're gonna go ahead and get this in there. Let it start to render down. And once that starts to render, we will add a sliced onion to the mix. We'll let it all caramelize, get nice and happy, and then we'll patty up some burgers. Bacon has been cooking. I'm going to add in the onions. Let these start to break down. I'm not going to salt the onions just because there's a lot of salt going on in this bacon. Oh, look at that. Onion overboard. So I'll give these a toss. Let these cook. Let them break down. Let them turn all nice and brown and caramelized and happy. And then we'll get to the uh, hamburger you know, the, the the protein of the meal. Actually, it'll be the second protein because bacon's probably a protein too. The onions and the bacon are pretty much cooked down to where I want. I'm gonna pull them off the heat. I'm gonna let these cool down. I'm gonna get this, I'm gonna get a griddle over here. And before I turn the griddle on, I am going to show you what we're gonna do with the burger. Here's the burger, I got, I got about a, um, it's about a pound of 80-20. Brown Angus, something or other. I have a cup, one cup of shredded Parmesan. I'm gonna add that right to the burger. No more salt because the cheese is salty. Just gonna throw some uh, cracked pepper. Give this the old mixeroo. And I'll, I'm gonna form these into two half pound patties. I'm gonna fire up the, the griddle. Now normally I am not one to do smash burgers on the griddle, but today I am because of the, the cheese that I put in here. I want it to get nice and crusty. I want it to get crisp. So I'm gonna set this on here. Now I don't have one of those fancy dandy burger crushers. So I got a spatula and a can. There we go. Let's do this other one. Give these a flip. Take out, see what they look like on the other side. Let's see if it works. Hey, look at that. All right, I'm gonna let those cook. Then we'll pull them off, let them rest. I will get them plated. Burger has rested. Now here's the bun we're going to use, nice soft bun, and to get that proper uh, bun to burger ratio, I just tore out a little bit of the top of the, a top of the bread. I'm going to go ahead and grab this patty, and put the patty right here, and you can see if you, the, the, the cheese has gotten nice and crusty that was in that patty. Go ahead and pile on. The onions and the bacon. Now to cut through the richness of the bacon and the onions, I decided to, it's a couple tablespoons of mayo and a couple tablespoons of Dijon mustard. Just to help break it a little. Might be a little 
you know, I don't know, that's a little messy, but who cares, right? So we're gonna put this on here. And me and Steve are about to eat. Grab half of your burger. I know. Over here. Mm -hmm. All right. Here's our burger. Cheers. Cheers. Oh. It's messy. It's excellent. Oh man. <laughs> The dogs, the dogs will get the scraps. The cheese really crusted on the patty, it's really good. The onions and the bacon, perfect. Not too salty, I was afraid it would be a little salty. No. Nope. But the perfect. mayo and the Dijon mustard work really good. So, we're going to continue eating. Now, it doesn't matter if you're smoking it, frying it, baking it, or griddling it with your buddy. Keep doing what you do. Take care. Later. I do that clapping thing a lot when I'm about to talk. Ready? We're gonna go. I'm gonna talk. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Where's the rudest motherfucker? <laughs> That's recording. I love it.